Palm oil is one of the most important and popular vegetable oils in the world, produced with a sophisticated and fascinating process. The journey begins from lush green palm plantations, where clusters of ripe fruit are harvested by a combination of skillful workers and powerful support from modern machinery. To optimize productivity and efficiency, So specifically, what happens during the process of turning raw palm fruit into drops of pure oil that appear in thousands of bottles of oil around the world? Let's discover the surprises and interesting things in today's video. The journey of palm oil begins in the tropical equatorial belt where vast plantations stretch to the horizon. In countries like Indonesia, the undisputed king of palm oil production with over 51 billion bottles per year, these plantations dominate the landscape and drive the economy. In the tropics, Palm trees thrive. Their bright red fruits grow in large clusters and must be harvested when fully ripe to ensure the best quality oil. The clusters weigh between 16 and 20 kilograms and harvesting them requires both strength and precision. Long poles with sickles are used to cut the clusters from trees up to six meters above the ground. In areas where heavy machinery is difficult to use due to the terrain, harvesters rely on hand tools and hand harvesting. While in more accessible locations, mechanical tools such as excavators help to load the fruit directly onto trucks, significantly reducing effort and time. Once the palm nuts are harvested, they are collected at collection points and then loaded onto larger trucks for transport to the mill. This step is critical as the nuts are perishable and timely delivery ensures the highest quality of extracted oil. Typically, the nuts are not sent to market in their raw form. Instead, they are transported directly from the plantations to the processing plants to maintain freshness and optimize processing efficiency. When nuts are unloaded at the mill, the nuts are unloaded and assembled in a single location. From there, front-loading forklifts scoop the nuts and place them on conveyor boxes, beginning the palm oil production phase at the mill. The next stage is separation and grading. palm fruit is separated from the bunch using a cluster beater that uses centrifugal force and vibration. The fruit is then separated into two streams. The mesocarp is used to produce crude palm oil, while the kernel is reserved for palm kernel oil.
Crude palm oil is extracted using a screw press that operates at a controlled temperature of 90 to 100 degrees Celsius. This process squeezes the oil from the mesocarp while preserving the rich carotene content and nutritional value of the fruit. Here, meanwhile, the inner kernels are separated through a gravity and aerodynamic classification system before being fed to a vertical screw press, where extreme pressure extracts the palm kernel oil from the heart of the fruit. The precision of this process ensures that only the highest quality oil is obtained, preserving essential nutrients and ensuring product consistency. The husks and shells, previously discarded as waste, are now reused, making the industry a model for circular economy principles. The empty fruit bunches, or EFBs, are dried, compressed, and turned into biofuels animal feed and building materials, significantly reducing environmental waste and contributing to sustainable practices. Once the crude oil is extracted, it still has to go through a complex refining process. Crude palm oil with its deep orange-red color and strong aroma can contain impurities that affect its usability. The refining process involves neutralization with sodium hydroxide, washing with warm water, decolorization with activated clay at temperatures ranging from 90 to 110 DEC, and deodorization with superheated steam under vacuum conditions of up to 260 DEC. Finally, the oil is cooled to 20 DC to separate the sterin and achieve the clear, golden appearance of refined palm oil. The final step in the production chain is packaging. Modern factories are equipped with high-speed conveyor systems that can fill up to 1,000 bottles per minute. Each bottle is capped and sealed using automated equipment to ensure hygiene and prevent contamination. Smart sensors then guide the labeling process to ensure accuracy before the bottles are boxed and shipped. What began in the heart of a tropical plantation is now ready for shelves around the world, a testament to both the efficiency and scale of the palm oil industry. Yet beyond its industrial might, the palm oil story is not without conflict. Mass cultivation has led to the destruction of more than 8 million hectares of tropical forest over the past quarter century, primarily in Indonesia and Malaysia. This deforestation has endangered countless species, including Sumatran tigers and orangutans. Moreover, the human toll of the industry is enormous. Plantation workers often endure harsh conditions, low wages, 
typically $150, zero cents to $300, zero cents a month, and limited labor protections, despite contributing to a global commodity worth billions of dollars. Injury rates on palm plantations are alarmingly high, far exceeding those in the construction and transportation industries, highlighting the physical risks involved. In short, the harvesting and processing of palm oil is a complex but well-coordinated operation that begins in the field and culminates in a refined, market-ready product. The process involves a seamless blend of human skill and machine power, combining age-old agricultural wisdom with cutting-edge technology. From the moment the fruit is plucked from the tree until it is refined, bottled, and shipped to consumers around the world, every step contributes to the production of one of the most widely used and economically important oils on the planet.